everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today, we have a special guest. This is Michelle Shepherdson. Hello. <laughs> Alright, so Michelle is a very, very talented ice skater, figure skater. She basically dances on ice and uh, this is her. And today we're going to do something fun. We are going to... Well, she's going to do a makeup tutorial and I'm going to follow. I don't know what you have planned. What yeah. do you have planned? I can't tell you. Okay. <laughs> She's not telling me, guys. So, it's a surprise. Let's yeah. get to it. Okay, yeah. so first we're going to prep our face. Okay. Uh, before I prep my face, I like to use my hand sanitizer. <laughs> and then I usually apply a serum. Moisturizer. Alright, so when did you get into figure skating? I started skating when I was about four, but then I didn't like it back then. <laughs> and then I started again when I was seven mm -hmm. with my school. I was from Sri Chahaya. Shout out Sri Chahaya! But it's now known as Real Education Group. Yes. So they, they introduced skating as like um, an cool, extracurricular, cool. yeah. Wow, it's a private school. Ah, it's a ice skating. It's a government school. So what Sorry. are you using now? Now I have sunblock. <laughs> <laughs> Do you prime your eyelids or just your face? Yeah, I prime my eyelids, but I use this to prime my eyelids. Oh, okay. It's underneath everything. What made you stay? After you were four years old, <laughs> I just really loved it. Like I enjoyed performing. It was I was doing ballet as well, but I found skating was a bit was a lot more sports oriented. What was one of your glorifying moments mm. as a skater? As a skater, yeah. I think it would be like those times. <laughs> those times when you get. Well, I'm very competitive, so whenever I get first, like, I, that's a really nice moment. <laughs> <laughs> so when you get second, it's not a nice moment. No, it's not. <laughs> but also, I think other than competitions, like, the satisfaction of doing your personal best. Yeah, yeah definitely. That is really rewarding. I agree. <laughs> Michelle is using this is the Too Faced Just Peachy palette and it's all matte. She's gonna be using this palette. This palette, however, does not stick on my skin tone, so what I am going to be using is the Urban Decay palette Born to Run. So the colors that she will be using are using colors from the Born to Run palette, I am using these colors. To start off, I'll be using this Zoeva 234 palette. Wow, wow, like, like, <laughs> yeah. 
Okay, and what color are you going so in with? So first, I'm gonna go with the peaches and cream. Like it's a very light color just to to get, get a base. base. Alright, so while she's using peaches and cream, I am going to be using Weekender. And where do you put that? Just the whole eye. <laughs> Okay, okay, very lightly. So where do you, where did you study um, ice skating? Um, I learned to skate in Sunway Pyramid Ice. Sunway Pyramid Ice. Shout out to yeah. Sunway Pyramid Ice. There's so many other like ice skating yeah, rinks now. now like, right? There are many rinks popping up, so I think you can find a, a skating rink that's closest to you. And then. We are going to go like um, a few moments later. So I'm going to use peach punch, which is this peachy color. Peachy color. And like emphasize more on the top part. The crease? Yes. Okay. I'll still put it everywhere, but more on the crease. Okay. Yeah. So while she's using that color, I'm actually going to go in with a darker color which is called Hell Right. So it's this color right here and I'm going to put that in my crease. See guys, I'm fair. I get somebody of different skin tones and show you all how you can do the same look. Okay, it's all nice and fair. So you put it in the crease, right? Yeah. This makeup thing look. that I'm doing, yeah, this look, it has to be a bit heavy. Because um, this is one of my skating makeup looks okay and there's a specific theme to it and usually when you're performing makeup has to be a little heavier yeah definitely see any kind of entertainment industry you kind of need to emphasize on all of your um, features so what do you do now with figure skating so now I'm a coach a coach yeah are you scary I think so. Some people say I am. <laughs> Gara, she no, but I really love coaching. I like working with kids and I think skating is something that I've always loved. Mm -hmm. So it's really great to be able to do what I love. Right. On a daily basis. So you all know ah, she garang ah, she already said. Yeah. She garang teacher. So once you're done with this, then I'm gonna use peach cobbler. Alright. And I think I'm gonna mix it a little bit with peach tart to get it darker than the peach punch. Okay. Um, and then I'm gonna basically put it at the corner here. Or the outer corner. Yeah. yeah. And create like um, that kind of Oh, eye. like a uh, cat eye? Yeah. Alright, so because she's using those colors, I am going to go in with still shot and with which is also a peachy color and a brownish color. Right now, I'm just loving my foundation. All right, let them know. The let them know. Estee Lord, Lord eh? <laughs> Double wear, stay in place makeup. It's like, I haven't tried it yet. Oh. It is also very expensive. <laughs> Please tell them the story about your foundation, my that foundation how long your foundation can last three years, I think. Four Her years. foundation lasts three years, but I don't use it anymore. I just have the bottle. <laughs> All right. So as you guys can see right now, she is just doing the outer corner, and her wing is so precise. <laughs> <laughs> you know how when you usually put makeup, you just like tap it a few times when you're done? But for this look, you kind of have to keep going at it over and over and over and over again. So why don't you use like a darker colour then? Because mm -hmm. I feel like it won't blend with this colour. Yeah. With my crease colour. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'm just going over and over and over. Alright, so what I've done with mine is I've literally just created a sharp wing. Obviously, I know that she's going to add something in the crease and that will blend out the sharp Why side. Am I? <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure you will because she has one more color left that she has not used. So what, what theme do you think we're doing? Like, what, I, what do you think? Peaches and cream! <laughs> Brownish color with my 
crease color, which was the peachy color. Are you mixing those two colors? Yeah, I'm just using a blending brush to oh, okay. just blend it. Okay, okay, tuka tuka. Change your brushes, guys. Do you usually do your eyes first or do yeah, you? Yeah, I usually do my eyes first. Always? Yeah, most of the time. Ah. If I'm doing a very heavy eye look, then I'll do my eyes first. But if it's like an everyday thing, mm -hmm. Um, I don't even do my eyes. Yeah, me too. I usually don't do eyes. I'll do my base, oh. but I won't. I won't do my. I won't do eyeshadow. Yeah. Cause that's just too, too much, much time. time. <laughs> Especially when you have to wake up at like six. Oh yeah, cause you wake up extra early. So I wake up at five on Tuesdays, Thursdays, Saturdays, and Sundays. At five, guys. <laughs> five o'clock. And I she looks and she still looks like this. No. She wakes up at five and she looks like this, guys. Uh, it's, sweet, la. it's true. Yes, it's true. Okay, so now oh, finish blending already. Yeah, oh wait, Auntie, wait, <laughs> Auntie's still blending. Auntie a bit Auntie a bit too. Okay. So now I'm gonna take some concealer and use a small brush and then I'm gonna brush it on my lower eyelids so is it a cut crease yes it's a cut crease but slightly bigger than the lower than the lower eyelid like I because my lower eyelid is quite small I'm so proud of you Michelle you're doing <laughs> a cut crease same concept um, I'm going to be taking the NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop Concealer in the shade Neutral 10 and basically cut my crease. Okay, so usually like once I'm done, I'll use a really bright color mm -hmm. depending on what look you're going for but... Okay, wait, so what colors are baju? It's like goldish, brownish... Oh, okay, alright. Okay, so I'm gonna use this really bright yellowy gold and then pop it to my eye. Okay, alright. So we're gonna use Inheritance from the Riviera palette, which is this beautiful goldish color. It is really nice. Yeah. Of course, super nice. And we're gonna put it all over the cut crease. Are we rich? Are we rich No, people? I'll give you a hint. It's not human. It's like, we're not human. It's not human? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Gold and peach. We're doing animal, is it? Yeah. <laughs> you say it's not human if we... <laughs> Could be monster. Apparently, it's not a monster. It is an animal. Yeah. Peach and yellow. Yeah, I don't think so much of the colour. <laughs> she <laughs> asked me to guess what it is. Sorry. <laughs> uh... <laughs> ah, bumblebee. Mm -hmm. Okay, maybe as we go on, you'll figure it out. Okay, what areas do you feel like you need to improve on? In life? Yeah, in life. I think I need to improve my patience. Girl, same! <laughs> same! Uh, but I think you're quite patient. Thank you. Because you know my boyfriend is good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, yeah. With her and her boyfriend, yeah. she's. I think she's very patient. <laughs> and I think I need to learn to relax more and like have some time to myself. You have two weeks now. Yeah. We're not done with the eye yet, but we're gonna go ahead and start our foundation. Okay, so we're doing a heavy look right today. Yeah. Because we're doing show makeup. We're doing yes. figure skating makeup. So we go in with foundation first. My favorite. <laughs> I don't know. So her shade is 3W1 in the shade Tawny. And I'm going to be going in with my NARS foundation in the shade Tahoe. This is the one that you guys always see me use. The only thing that I don't like about this foundation is that it doesn't have a pump. 
Right. Mac, use, Mac's one also doesn't have a pump. And, but you can buy it separately. But it's so expensive. Nah, this one, I think it's 25. Mahal. Okay, so we're going in with foundation first. And how do you apply your foundation? So I just dot, dot, dot. Okay. And then I'll use my brush. Ah, she uses a brush. Yeah. Guys, look at how much foundation she has on her hand. Please show your oh, hand. My hand. <laughs> look at that. It's a whole hand. Yeah, it's a bit too much. <laughs> it's because there's no pump, right? Yeah. Okay, because she's using a brush, I am also going to use a brush. I'm going to be using a stippling brush. Obviously, it's very dense. And we're just going to blend that out into the skin. Okay, I'm using Shape Tape by Tarte. Right. In the shade 36S. 36S? Okay. Medium tan set. And I'm gonna go back in with my NYX concealer, Can't Stop, Won't Stop, in the shade Neutral Tan. I just cover all my pimples. <laughs> so I'm gonna use the Robert Welsh technique of what he taught. For example, you just use two small dots and one dot outside, that is more than enough. Yeah, try it. Two small dots inside and one dot outside. This way, your makeup won't cake. And then I'm going in with my finger and I'm just going to blend out the under eye very gently. Um, what are your greatest qualities as a person? I think I'm caring. Very. You are very loving. caring. Yes. Yeah, I think those two. But yeah, sometimes it takes a while for people to see that. She is very loving, guys. Very, very loving. She'll cry at everything and everything. <laughs> <laughs> it's just because she feels so intensely. Like, but I think you're the same, right? No. Uh, yeah, very loving. Thank you. So what are you doing now? So next, I'm just gonna powder my face with Studio Fix. Studio Mac. Fix. She's one of the OGs and what... <laughs> I don't even know what shade I'm in. And 42. I am going to go in with the drugstore brand, which is Maybelline Fit Me in the shade um, Toffee Caramel. This just cost 30 ringgit. Yeah, the 40. <laughs> Mahal, <Stop yeah>. it. <laughs> This cost 30 ringgit and that cost about 100 something. But I've been using this for so long. <laughs> I'm kind of shy to tell the camera. Like, I think. Let me count. Oh god, it's really. I think 4 years. Okay! Okay, so next I'm gonna bronze my face. I'm not sure if that's what you call it, but I'm using Hula Benefit bronzer. For this look, I'm gonna make it a little heavy, like a little. Okay, heavy. so stronger. Yeah, yeah stronger. Yeah. Because remember, we're animals. <laughs> So I'm going to be using my NARS bronzer in the shade Casino. You all have seen me use this a million times by now. And I'm just going in with an angle brush, even though I used to use a fluffy brush last time. But I realized with an angle brush, I get more precision. So next, I'm going to take a small fluffy brush. Mm -hmm. And then I'm just going to bronze or contour my nose. Like to make it sharp. Like this has to be really long. Dark. Oh, it has to be dark. Okay, I'm gonna use the color riff since we're not humans. Ah, like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. I have. I'm just following like the bone. Like you know when you look at your nose, with the bone here just yeah. two lines down. Are you bringing it up to your eyebrow? Yes. Okay. Now, can you guess what animals we are? Deers. No. Are we becoming Bambi? No, but it kind of looks like Bambi actually. But the look is not Bambi? No. Just so you all know, I don't know what this look is! <laughs> so once, once I'm done with the nose, I'm gonna go ahead and take my 
um, illuminating palette from Kat Von Woz. Yeah, and you can just use whichever highlight you want. But I think I'm going to go with the Gucci one. Okay, so just take some product and just go in the middle of the two lines. Okay. And I also use the same highlight to just highlight my cheekbones. Okay. We are going to go ahead and do our eyebrows. Okay, so it'll just be like normal, like how you do your eyebrows on a daily basis, but a little bit darker. Okay, a little bit darker. So I'm using the Precisely My Brow Pencil from Benefit in the shade 4 when I usually use 3. Oh, okay. Yeah. I am just going with my cyber colors. This is in the shade Dark Brown. So during this uh, movement control thing, yeah. what has been a few things that you've been doing now that you haven't done in a long time? I wouldn't say it's stuff that I haven't done in a long time, but I just have more time to do. Mm. Like now I get to cook more and bake more. Oh yeah, she's an amazing baker. An Thank amazing you. baker. I just have more time to read. And what relax. are you reading now? I'm reading this book called Ikigai. To live, I think like a, a happy, well-balanced kind of life. Right. What about you, Moana? Some things that you've been doing. I've been painting, um, coming up with new melodies for like Picasso, reading, currently on the book called, um, wait, I can't remember the name of the book, but it's by Eckhart Tolle, and then moving on with the Japanese brow gel. Yes, after that to give it a more like full effect, I'm gonna use the Benefit brow gel. I am gonna go in with my mascara. Little tip, if you don't have brow gel but you're doing not a natural look, you can use mascara to make it full. So just take your mascara. Oh, nice. And it stays exactly the same way as a brow gel, I feel. And it also makes it slightly darker. And then to emphasize the brows, I'm just going to go in with a bit of concealer. Okay. And just put it here. Oh, uh, on the arch of your yeah. brow bone? Okay. Now we're going to go um, uh, eyeliner. Okay. Like the kind of like a... I don't know what you call it, the top one. Top one? Where you draw it like a wing. A wing eyeliner? Yeah. So I want to make this a bit more dramatic. So I'm going to pull the, the wing a little bit. To about where? To like, you know where my eyeshadow is? Mm -hmm. So I'll just follow that like three quarter. Okay. Three quarter. Go in with, with a pencil liner mm -hmm. and just like go. Uh, do the waterline. Yeah, waterline and like uh, top and bottom. Okay. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this white eyeliner and just go over, like draw outside of the black eyeliner okay to create like this jungle feel. so we know it's jungle now right that gives it an even more defined look it works oh it looks very nice it's a bit messy but it's okay then after this i'm just gonna use mascara and just do like normal mascara how do you get your students to take care of themselves i think it's very important to monitor them if they're over like if they're pushing themselves a bit too hard as a coach you have to know when to readjust their schedules and 
every everyone's body is different, so yes, yeah. there's, there's no like specific way, but I do tell them get enough sleep, eat vitamins, or if you don't have energy for class, take a supplement. I don't know whether supplements work, but for some of them, it does. It does, yeah. And your students, what age range are they? I have right now from about four to four to five till fourteen. Okay. Yeah, I have an adult student as well, but she's not competitive. Even then, if they're not competitive, they can still join. Yeah. Okay. So we're powdering the nose. We're powdering the nose and the the upper lip, like a powder that's lighter than your skin color, so like translucent powder. Yeah. So I'm gonna just take the black gel liner. Mm -hmm. Wait, are we doing Lion King? Yeah. <laughs> big nose, I won't go all the way to the bottom, then it will kind of look like a bear, but we're not bears. Why did she sing it? <laughs> it's okay. It's just... I don't know how to straighten this up. Okay, where do you put the lines? Oh, you do it on the cupid's bow? So we have already done our nose and the thingies. <laughs> so what's next? So now we're gonna line the lips. Okay, not line, just line and fill in the top lip. Okay. Black. Okay. Yeah. So do you have any um, future goals? Or is there anything mm. that you are looking forward to? I like to like take my coaching career further. Mm -hmm. and the goal is to be an Olympic coach. I mean, it's, but there's a long way more to get there. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to go in with a very pinky lip. So I'm using the Kat Von D Mother. <laughs> because I don't have a super pink lip, what I'm doing is I'm just taking my red lip liner and then I'm just taking my NARS uh, lipstick in the shade Slow Ride Okay, and then just take your eyeliner mm -hmm. so I'm gonna use my liquid one just do some small little dots like and then I'm just gonna draw the whiskers so like Two. I just like doing two one dot. I have three whiskers. Okay. Or you can do it however you want. Yours looks cute. Mine looks like I don't know. No, it looks really nice. Yours looks nice and controlled. No, I think mine looks like a really. <laughs> A really <laughs> organized cat. <laughs> like how you are in life. <laughs> Not your room now, but yeah, everything else is quite organized. Is it done? Yeah. We're done! Just setting spray to so, uh, do you gonna come setting spray, yeah? So what though? what spray do you use? I use the um, Urban Decay all night. Okay. And this is our final look! watching. So do you have anything that you want to say to aspiring boys and girls who might want to join figure skating? I think if you want to do it, just go all in for it and you know, be committed in anything you want to do. <laughs> yeah. Otherwise <laughs> she's gonna come scolding <laughs> you. You better be committed. Okay, thank you so much Michelle. She is has brought back the creative spark. With cute little <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. I will link everything about this beauty in the description link down below. And if you have any other suggestions, let me know in the comments below. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!